What's up everyone, Zero here. So I wanted to put together a quick video about PoE Ninja. This is a tool that we use in Path of Exile 1. So if you are new to PoE, this is going to benefit you greatly. The URL is poe2.ninja. Now if you look here on the homepage, you can choose from builds, passive skill tree, or you can opt to share your own POB through Path of Building. Click right here on the builds. It's going to break it up into four categories, solo self-found, standard, hardcore solo self-found, or just regular hardcore. Just to make this really simple, let's just go over to the standard league. Up here at the top, it has the percentage of the ascendancies that are being played. So as you can see here, 33% of the people that have shared their POB to POE Ninja are playing the Stormweaver. 24% are playing the Gemling Legionnaire. Let's say I wanted to sort it by Stormweaver builds. I would click here. Now over here, you can see the name of the character, the level that they're at, the amount of life that they have, the amount of energy shield that they have, their estimated hit pool, their DPS, and which keystones they are using in their passive tree. You are able to sort by any one of these. So if I click descending, I can see the person who has the most life. All I do is I click on their name, and I can see their entire build. I can see over here on the right, their stats column, their attributes, movement speed, etc. Over here on the left, I can see the items that they have. I can even click on their weapon swap to see what they have. I can see their flasks, their charms, and all the jewels inside of their passive tree. Scroll down here and you can actually see their passive tree. And over here on the right, the keystones are listed. You scroll down here, you can actually see the gems that they are using as well as the links almost forgot to mention up here in the corner on the character screen you can copy the path of building code pop over here to path of building go to import build right click in here and import it and there you go you have it in your path of building back to the character page over here on the left you can sort by builds that are using a specific item or not using a specific item. So let's say I wanted to see all the builds that are Stormweaver that are using Ingenuity. I would click on this and it's gonna sort them right here. Now let's say I wanted to find all the builds that are not using Ingenuity. I would click this little circle with a line through it and it's going to list all of the builds that do not have an ingenuity. If you go down here to this main skills column, you can find, you can sort by all of the skills that they have six linked. So for instance, if I wanted to see everybody that had spark six link, I could click on that and it's gonna sort them here. Now let's say I wanted to see all the ones that have spark six linked, but are also using acceleration. I would click that here. Now I wanted to see, let's say I wanted to see all the builds that have a specific passive. I would click down here and it's going to give me all the builds that are using constant gale. And from there on, it's pretty self-explanatory. This is a really, really good tool if you're struggling with build creation and you kind of want to see what other people are doing. What I'll do a lot of the times, especially in PoE1, is I will find a build archetype that I really like or a specific skill that I want to build around and I will look at what other people are doing and it will help direct my decision making when I'm trying to create my own build so it really helps out a lot so yeah that's pretty much it it's pretty self-explanatory but I did want to make a video on it because it's a very very helpful tool if you guys found that useful at all like and subscribe for more content like that and I will see you guys next time peace